Hello, my name's Monique, and welcome back to my channel. Um, I fucked up. <laughs> Excuse my language. I, I've had to um, redo this video five times. So hopefully this time I got it. Uh, my Kindle uh, ebook unhaul. The books on my Kindle that I have bought this month. I bought 21. And I'm trying not to start my Kindle books until after I read, it, read all my physical books. So maybe I'll mix it in a little. We'll, we'll see in the future. Um, the books that I purchased... Um, If it'll let me upload it. Hang on just a second. Hi, I'm back. Um, I had to get my Kindle tablet because my phone's acting up. I don't know why. But the first book I got is Joe Hill, Full Throttle. Um, this is supposed to be a Netflix movie coming out soon, so I want to read the book um, before I um, before I watch the movie. But um, let's see, let's see if it says what it's about. Um. Thirteen Reasons the Tales of Supernatural Suspense includes In the Tall Grass, one of the two stories Stephen King is based off for the trilogy. A little door opens to a, to a world of fairy tales. Wanders become the bloody lynch for the gang of hunters. A grief thickened librarian climbed behind the wheel of an antique bookmobile to deliver the flesh grades to the dead in late in late returns hmm sound like it's going to be a good book but like I said I want to read that first before I start the movie. The next one I bought uh, Strange the Dreamer. This is uh, Leaning Taylor's uh, book after, I think after um a, uh, a Daughters of Smoke and Bone series. I think she did this one after that. So I'm reading Daughters of Smoke and Bone series um, book this month on a read-along. And they're doing a read-along on this, but I can't keep up because I've already got four read-alongs I'm already keeping up with. So I will have to skip this one and do it when I got time to do it. But um, I heard a lot of good things about this. Uh, Darian this is her favorite series out of her book, so I can't wait to see what she's talking about with all the hype. Um, but we'll see. The next one. This is the second book. Uh, assume of nightmares um, they say once you start start this series I've heard that you gotta finish it or you won't understand it um, but it will keep you locked once you start it you cannot stop uh, I heard that from um, I forgot who said that but I'm gonna look it up later and figure it out um, but this is the second book in her uh, stranger dreamer so I can't wait to see what the fuss is all about. I cannot wait. The 
the next one I bought six of crows I've heard a lot of things about this six dangerous outcasts one impossible heist so there's six people one heist that's all I want to know um, but I've heard good things about it um, I got the first book which is six of crows and then I got the second one the crooked kingdom so I will be starting these books soon uh, and I will give you all a full full book review on these um, but um, I've heard a lot of good things about them that's the reason why I bought them on my Kindle because I'm running out of room for book physical books so I gotta buy everything on Kindle now so uh, but I can't wait to see what happens And there's the second one. When you can't beat the odds, change the game. So I can't wait to see what the fuss is about. This is the second book in the uh, Crooked Kingdom of um, Six of Crows. Uh, like I said, they're doing a read along in this this month, but I can't attend because I'm already in four read alongs. Um, but um, maybe I can get to them at, like I said, after I finish all my physical books, I can get to my Kindle books. Or I might mix it up. We'll, we'll see. The next one I bought. Oh, let me see if I can fix it, guys. There we go. Six of Cro uh sorry. It's King of Scars. This is by Lee Bardugo. Um, she's got a uh, book coming out March 30th, the second book. This is a duology. A duology. Um, this is the first one. Uh, the second one is Rule of Wolves. And um, I'm going to buy it when it comes out. That way I have both of them. So when I do start it, I can jump right into the second one. So I can't wait to actually start this. I've heard a lot of good things about this series. All her books are, are fantastic that I've read so far. So, I can't wait to see what happens. The next one I bought. Skyward. Hold on, guys. The next one I bought. Skyward. Um, I've read all Brandon Sanderson's, Brandon Sanderson's, uh, Storm, Storm, uh, la, 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 Storm Alight Archives, and I've just read his, um, Mistborn Air 1, so I bought this, um, so I can pick it up, there's two books to it. This is the first one, Sky War. Um, I heard a lot of good things about it. And the second one is Star, Star Sight, I think is what it was. Star Sight, yeah. This is book number two in the Star uh, Sky, Sky War. I can't wait to pick this up because once I pick up a Sanders book, I try to finish to the end. No matter how many he puts in there, I try to finish. Brandon Sanders is my top. Well, Stephen King, Brandon Sanders, Sarah J. Mask, and then uh, Lee Bardugo. So there's the four. I, oh, I take it back. Five. Um, Tracy De Dion that did Legendborn. She's in there too. So I got five new favorite authors. Um, but I can't wait to start it. Like I said, once I start it, 
once I start a, a, a Brandon Sanderson book, I'm in it to the end. Uh, next one. His next one I bought. Uh, the next one I bought Arkham Unbound, the Cosmere Collection. Uh, it says you have to read the Cosmere and the Mistborn, all of them, before you read this. So, I read Error, Mistborn Error 1, but I've not read Error 2, so I will be reading that first before I start this one, uh, and see what's all the fuss. And the next one. The uh, the alloy of law. This is era two, uh, two from Mistborn from Brandon Sanders. Like I said, once I start his books, I'm in it to the end until I get the full throttle of it. Um, but I bought book one. I bought book two. The Shadows of Self and The Bounds of Morgan. So I got all three of them. So when I do start it, I'm in it. Oh, blah, 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 blah. The next one A Court of Wings and Ruin. I bought this on my Kindle because it was on sale. For a dollar ninety nine, I could not pass that up. I, I'm sorry, I I couldn't do it. I couldn't pass it up, to save my life. I I love deals on Kindle, so. But um, I got the physical book. It's on my TBR for March. Um, but when I'm not reading my physical book, I can read this at night. And uh, cause like I said, my wife sleeps after eleven, so I I can stay up and read a little bit till about one or two in the morning, and then. I got my e-copy with the audio I could follow along. Now how good of a deal is that? My next one. A Bow So Bold and Deadly. This is book number three in uh, A Curse of So Dark So Lonely. I've not started that series. I got both physical books on my shelf, my TBR. I will be starting them soon. And I went ahead and bought this because this was on sale. I got it for like eight ninety nine. dollars um, But I heard good things about this series. It's a um, um, Beauty and the Beast retelling. That's all I want to know. So... Oh, next one. The next one I bought. The next one I bought. Red Rising by Pierce uh, Brown. Um. I got the whole series, all five books on my ebook for $26, I think. I have seen on everybody's channel the hype on this book. I can't watch it because I've not read the book. So I can't watch the spoilers. I was hoping they would do spoiler free so I can see what it's basically about. But most of them did spoilers. So I, I didn't get to. Um, I didn't get to um, do it 
So, I'm going to have to figure this out on my own. Right now, Leslie, the, the nerdy narrative, Leslie is reading this series. I think she's on book number two. Um, but I will start this soon. Uh, it's on the back burner for now. Like I said, I'm trying to get all my physical books done. Um, and we'll just go from there. I might go back and forth. I might jump into my ebook. Let one of my physical books go. We'll see. See how it goes, right? That's the first one. There's the second one. The Golden Sun. The third one, Moon Morning Star. I think these covers are so pretty. Every one of them. I think they're gorgeous. And the fourth one, Iron Gold. And the fifth one, Dark Age. So, I got all five of them. So, when I do start it, I'll be set when I get into it. Okay. The next one I bought, I got both of these for uh, $12.99, I think. Uh, this is Mayor Reed's favorite series. And I've heard a lot of talking about this series. Um, I don't know if there's going to be a book three in this. Um, let me see if I can find out real quick. Okay, apparently there's three three books in this series, so I'm gonna wait till I get all three books, so that way I can start it and finish. Um, the first one is Fearborn. It's a it's a trilogy, so there's three books, and then King's Bang is book number two, and then um, Lightbringer is uh, book three. So. There's book four, book one, Legendborn. Book two, The Bang. And then here's book three, The Lightbringer. Sorry guys, my lighting sucks there you go uh, that's the third one so I have to buy it next month so I have all three but um, I'm gonna be starting that series soon like I said that's Mayor's uh, Mayor Reed's favorite um, trilogy and I can't wait to start it and The next one I bought, The Sword of, of Creon. Um, 
uh, ML1, better to die sharp in the war than rust through a time of peace. Uh, this was Stephanie's favorite book, and I'm hoping to get to it very soon. So far, it's, it's a standalone. What I've heard, um, I don't know for sure, so we'll find out soon enough. Next one I bought. Um, from Blood and Ash. This is book. This is a book. Uh, book number one in the um, uh, trilogy. Um. I heard a lot of good things about it, so I went ahead and purchased it. Um, book two is um, Kingdom of Flesh and Fire. So I can't wait to start this series. I got both books. Uh, book number three is um, The Crown of Guillotine Bones. Um, it's not coming out till April 20th of this year, 2021. So. I'm not going to read this until I have all three books. That way I'm I'm ahead of myself. So I don't have to worry. The next one. Um, I've heard mixed reviews on, on um, Spiritual Dove and Blood and Honey. <sighs> I've heard a lot of mixed reviews. Um, the third book comes out August 3rd, 2021. But the first one is Spiritual Dove by Shelby Morning. I think it is her name. Uh, but like I said, this is book one. Uh, I got book two, The Blood and Honey. And then book three I have to get when it comes out which is um, August 3rd 2021 so I'll have all three of them then that way I'll be able to read all three of them um, I think I've showed you all my Them's all the books I bought on my Kindle. Um, let me know down in the comments what y'all think of uh, the books that I'm going to be reading soon. Um, I hope y'all like this video. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Give it a thumbs up. And I will see you in my next video. And happy reading. Bye.